Hello and welcome to episode 4 of Let's Play Civilization 6 Japan. Uh, we are continuing where we last left off. Um, right now we've concluded the war with the Sumerians. We achieve our strategic objective. Um, uh, but it's kind of that phase in the game where I th I'm sure if you played Civ before, you you had that feeling where you had so many things to do. Like you want to do this, you want to do that, expand, build military, build infrastructure, everything in one go. And there's not enough production, <laughs> obviously, to go around. And you're kind of lost because there's too much to do. And I'm, I'm feeling that right now, actually, because, you know, this is a really strong opening. I have to say, like one of the strongest openings I can see, it's the luck of the geography, the uh, mountain range here, it completely protects me from the Sumerians. They can only attack from here, and I'm going to block their way down. Uh, and you know, the AI isn't that great in terms of uh, unit management, so I'm pretty confident that I can stall them with two encampments here and some range units. Obviously, once they get their sailing going, they're going to sail around here and settle cities back here. So they might be able to move units up, but uh, you can see here, I have so much room to expand. I'm going to expand down here. That's another bottleneck. Even if they get down here, uh, well, the land isn't that great, but this is probably some choice spots down here. But we have basically this side of the continent to ourselves. Someone might try to settle down here later. Uh, who knows? But... I think we have at least this area secured to ourselves for now. So I'm in a good position, but there's so much to do. Uh, I'm trying to do A, B, C, and D at the same time. I'm really worried that I'm going to get distracted doing everything at once. So I'm trying to be focused. So I'm turning Tokyo into a com uh, industrial city. I want to get another uh, commercial, sorry, uh, another scientific district up to get my research up. I don't want to fall too far behind on culture as well, so I'm building some amphitheater here. And Tokyo, uh, Kyoto is doing uh, research so that I can earn great people points to get my next great scientist. I'm leading here slightly, uh, and I'm pretty sure I have lost a few already, uh, because the AI can actually uh, earn great people points that way too. They know how to use the, uh, the build order. No, we're not going to attack them. Okay, so let's get uh, uh, that an ancient walls next. Let me heal them up. So yeah, I'm happy that the Sumeria Sumerians uh, are not bounded by water. It's uh, oh, apologies. So, because they'll have to worry about their other side of their borders, they can't concentrate all their forces this way, which is good. Uh, right. Oh, oh, that's Egypt. Egypt. And gotta get a walls up here as well because this is a little bit vulnerable. Obviously, they can attack here right away. And all the walls does is it gives your cities range attack and it stalls their attack because they have to get through your HP bar first before attacking your city itself. Your HP bar is basically your walls, or rather, there are two HP bars because you have your health bar and then your walls. So, okay. Okay, that's going to be done soon. Supar needs food. Okay. Let's get a granary going. I'm going to risk that. On. Yeah, the Germans are actually spending, are doing what we're doing too, but they're using a much better production city than we are, so they're actually vaulting ahead. 
I think. Unless I get all the points at the end of it. No, we're not going to attack. Uh, at the end of the process. So, we'll see. Okay, so Gilgamesh is not at war with the Germans, which is good. Awe, Viator. Augusta e Roma Imperator Caesar Traianus Sum. Quis es? Qua e terra patria vocas. Trajan. Um, my second or third game with him. I'm not sure if they were, he was in my first Let's Play, but I like that they, they, they select uh, Trajan as the uh, great leader for, um, or the leader for the Romans, because we've always been gotten Caesar. Uh, I think we got Augustus instead of five, which is a nice change, but Trajan is kind of the. Um, much of, uh, I guess, a leader of the late, later empire. So we're not kind of stuck with the Caesars. Um. Somos una nación de fe, y vuestro favor a nuestra devoción os honra. Yeah, okay, so we convert to, I guess, our cities are mostly Catholic, so they like us better because of that. Uh, make deal. Can we do anything here? Ah, we'll take. Let's go for that. I wanna. I don't know if we'll get it, but that's a good boost to have for our uh, army. Basically, every unit gets a free promotion. war with the Germans. That's where all their units are. Gonna move my spear back as well, right here. A good <clears throat> navy is not a provocation to war. It is the surest guarantee of peace. So I should be able to build a uh, another district after the next growth. I'm going to buy a... Nope, nope. Wrong selection. Back to the samurai. We're going to buy a builder. There we go. There are the Germans. Purpose of education is to uh, do that.
Ente knensha hu er hepper en bach pai en. Pai ek mesha hezi. Okay, Egypt doesn't like us because our army is weak. Uh, arguable, but okay, I agree. Oh, I, sh I should have cleared this one instead of that. Kind of dumb. Uh, let's build it here. Build a farm here instead. Uh, we'll send this to Sendai. Our walls up now. Barbarian caravan already. See where I can improve it. Okay, I see. military power by the way so the Germans are not behind us and actually the Sumerians also behind us now so we're actually not bad just not the best but in our little area we're pretty good hmm Germans do have seems to have a lot of room to expand up here To the apples on the Dead Sea shore, all ashes to the taste. That's nice.
Oh, we lost Lisbon. That sucks. Someone's been dumping uh, envoys into them. Uh, let's do a commercial. Ditissimas tui regni regiones diripendas ostibus dauisti. I agree. Propagatio okay. adio te terret. I'm working on it. People can have the Model T in any color, so long as it's black. Holy sight. Uh. Oh, they do like our military, the Germans, because we are stronger than them. Merchant still, commercial hub, we'll get that. Great artist. So many things to build at the same time, it's very hard to do everything at once. With all these constraints going on, I mean, if I have unlimited production, no, it, be, it wouldn't be a problem. Okay, get a workshop up, and then I'm gonna try to get a, a university here, and then holy site somewhere here, if I can. No, I can't do that. Let's see, can we get them more? No. Only three gold is their price. Chocolate and three gold. We have them covered away to increase our farm. With the advance of feudalism. Campus going. Going to buy a uh, builder here. I might get that wonder. I wasn't expecting to get it, but I will get it. Looks like. Betwixt there were seven wonders in the world, and the discovery of the terracotta army, we may say, is the eighth miracle of the world. Fix the stirrup and the ground, mercy I asked. Mercy.
Yeah, I think I was saying earlier that swords don't upgrade to samurai, and I can see here that they don't. So a lot of the strategies that rely on slingshotting from like, you, know, you build a bunch of crappy units, save up a bunch of gold, and then just go uh, all the way, don't quite work here. to save his promotion. great people we want. We're not really doing that great in terms of getting great people. There is the coast, at least. Ah, oh, the Egyptians just built a city. I knew that's going to happen eventually. But they're isolated. I'm not too concerned at the moment. Settle too close to us, apparently. We're going to ignore your request. I want to leave my options open there. Being a mercenary, though, hey. I need to get another builder out here to improve some of these forests.
We're gonna denounce them and then attack them. I think I want the city. Settler going here. Thank you. You can think whatever you want to think. Oh, I see their settlers down here. I don't like that. Block their path there. It's going to force them to sail all the way down here. This just puts me in a bad position though because um, I have no gold income. see a castle under fog you must walk there to me
Still no Casas Belli to go. So my next city is going to be here. It's going to grab all these resources in this silk down here and just block uh, any path northwards. is good okay I think um, once the turn ends we will end our turn here and I will pick up the next time just waiting for the turn to finish Thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time.